One of the most common questions that beginner guitarists ask is how difficult is it to learn how to play the guitar? And the answer is it's not very difficult. It takes a bit of time and um, you have to follow some plan, okay, in order to get the best possible results, okay? So let's try to build some simple plan. The first step will be to learn chords, okay? So chords are the shapes that I'm holding here on the neck, okay, on my guitar. So you have to learn some shapes like A minor, C major, D major, E major, okay? Because the shapes are the building blocks of the songs, okay? So if you want to play any song, the song certainly will have some combination of the chords. Many times um, the songs will have um, similar chords, but kind of blended in a different way, okay? So learning the shapes, the chords is the first and one of the most important steps, okay? Second thing will be to learn some transitions between these chords because one thing is to learn the shape A minor, C major, E major and all this stuff but second thing is be able to actually change between these shapes, okay? So in your practice sessions you have to kind of include working on the transitions between the shapes, okay? So going from one chord to the next one and trying to be um, you know, quite quick with the changes. It takes time, okay? So don't expect that you'll be able to do it in one or two days, okay? It may take a few weeks. But um, again, with some, um, with some, you know, persistence, you will get good results. The third thing, you need to learn some rhythm. By rhythm, I mean doing something with this hand, okay? So you're going to hit the strings in a, in a special way to create the sound from the chords that you are holding, okay? So you have to learn some basic rhythm structures, okay? So um, this is step number three. Again, it takes time because um, to strum on one chord might be pretty easy, but now to change between the shapes and keep strumming will be much more difficult, okay? So this is the third step, okay? Learning some rhythm. The fourth step will be then trying to integrate this into the songs, okay? So then you can, once you know some simple um, shapes, then you can try to find out which songs you'll be able to play with the scores that you've learned, okay? And um, you can find a um, few examples on my website, guitarcouch.com. I am teaching very simple, basic um, beginner chords and songs in these lessons, okay? So you can always check it. Okay, so um, learning the shapes, making, working on the transition to the chords is very important. The rhythm, because the rhythm kind of bond everything together and learning the songs, okay? And now look, at the top of this, it's very important to have some kind of the plan. You have to know what you want to achieve. So let's say you want to learn some song, okay? What you could do once you set up your plan, you can create, um, let's say, you can divide this into very specific steps, okay? So one step will be to learn the chords from this song, okay? Memorize the shapes. The second step will be to improve the transitions between these shapes, okay? So make sure that you can move kind of in a fluent way between these shapes, yeah? The third step will be to learn some rhythm, okay? And then integrate everything together into the song. Now keep in mind that um, it will take some time. You cannot just um, probably at the beginning take the chords and play the song, okay? So this is why I'm dividing this into some simple steps um, so you can create your own schedule, okay, for yourself. Now look. The most important thing probably is, is to be persistent, okay? You have to spend some time with the instrument. So um, you have to practice on a kind of regular basis, okay? You don't have to practice for hours every single day, okay? But let's say practicing for three, four days per week for five, ten minutes will give you the best possible results probably at this level because it will give you enough time to recover from the session, to um build the strength in your fingers to memorize the stuff because don't forget also when you don't practice your mind still processes the information and kind of remembers everything okay after a while you remember things better okay so it takes time to memorize the things okay so practicing for four days three days per week for five ten minutes would be perfect if you follow this plan i guarantee you in few few months two three months you'll be able to play some um, some simple songs. If you have any questions, you can always ask me the questions on my website, guitarcouch.com, or on the Facebook, Twitter. Um, you can post the question under this video on YouTube um, or Vimeo. <laughs> it's, it's 
plenty of options okay and i try then to do the video for you with my with my guitar tips <laughs>